Hello, welcome to Panty of the Geeks. This is an unboxing video for the Malifaux The Kin set, which is Ophelia and the Band of Merry Men. Look at the back, that's what you get in the box. Mind the light again. You've got Ophelia, Francois, Raphael, Perry Revanche, Three Young Lacrocs, and Rami. So these are basically the, uh, the Neverborn Goblins, Gremlins, whatever you want to call them. Um, version of Ferita's gang. So these guys have kind of copied the uh, humans that have come through into Malifaux and been quite successful at it. So Ophelia thinks she's Perdita. So I had to get hold of this because I like the gremlins and I don't have any gremlin models. These are the first gremlin models I've ever had. But the gremlins are now a faction on their own are they? They are in the second edition yeah. of Malifaux. They're no, they're no longer attached as with the outcasts. They're attached. The outcasts. You know it's weird because they are never born. Basically, yeah. everything in Malfoy is basically connected to the Neverborn. These are sort of Neverborn guys, but now they've got their own faction as gremlins, which is great. <laughs> um, and the thing that put me off before is I don't really, I'm not, I don't know whether I like some Matif Jones or not. Mm. Um, the other, the other, uh, the other, the other gremlin. Guy. I always liked this box set, but she was only a henchman. She was, yeah, that's and, true. And you couldn't really, you couldn't feel use her don't... effectively as, no. as a as a master. Until now, so now she's actually a fully fledged Malfo leader. So we'll get this box open and we'll have a look at the models and we'll get them together. And um, so what we get in here. If you haven't seen the Malfo models before, I mean, we've already done a video on a Reza group that I've got, which is Nicodem. Um, mm -hmm. If you haven't seen them, please have a look, because uh, the models are very different to... Uh, Excuse the squeal there. Squeal. Or just a pig. A little piggy <laughs> in there. Again, you can find those to put these together online. You get the cards in the box set. These ones I don't already have because I never bought the Gremlins. Which are these new for me. And uh, we've got the bases, which are the round beveled edged lipped bases. Which are the same as the previous box set that we've got. There's a large one in there as well. And uh, here's what we get in it. So this is the sprue. And there you go. And each little box is one of the gremlins. Each one's a character. It's not like spread all over the place like a Games Workshop sprue. So each one of these will be one of them, for instance. Uh, that one's Ophelia, right there in the corner. And all the parts for her are on that. And so on. It divides them up. It's very cleverly done. It's easier to find the bits. Anyway, put it that yeah. way on the Games Workshop sprue. So you don't really need the instructions. Found what you got, what you're putting together there. Who's that? That's Rami. So he's the guy with the uh, the bigger gun on the back. So what we'll do, we'll get this gang together, and then we shall show you the gang once they're done. And I will. Uh, this is my first gremlin gang, so look forward to putting these together and getting them painted as well. So uh, we'll be back with you in a moment once they're together. And welcome back. So there's uh, a feeling of gang put together. Um, a little bit of a faff, to be honest. <laughs> Took a little while. Yeah. So they're going to need to use cutting mats and knives and tweezers. Quite a lot of that, to be honest. That's why I've used anyway. Um, for the bases, I've used green stuff. I've used balsa wood, and they're going to go for like a bayou swampy effect. So like bits of uh, old wood floating in the swamp. That's what I'm going to plan on doing anyway. We'll see what happens. Um, so that's what the things on the bases are. You can see. Be like rotting wood. So I'll just take you through the models. Starting with the uh, young Lacroix, which are the totems. I've got this one here that's uh, bearing his arse to the world. There he goes. Dropping his trousers. Brilliant. <laughs> it's quite a funny model. And we've got this one here. He is another young Lacroix. These are the totems for Ophelia. She's come up to three. Um, this one, she's firing a gun which is far too big for her and going flying backwards. I love the motion on these models, <laughs> they do look amazing. Uh, the final of the totems uh, this, yep, is these two guys, one still on the shoulders of the other with a uh, slingshot and a massive hat. There they are. And then we have Raphael here. Can I get hold of him? Oop. I've retrieved him from the floor. There he is. 
There's like a, like a shotgun thing going on there, isn't he? <laughs> so that's Raphael. What do you want next? Um, just pass me one, will you? Yep. So this is um, Rami. There he is. With his massive multi-shotgun there, which you're going to need a knife to take off, otherwise it will break. Which I found out. He's also got a pig on the back end of the gun, acting as a, as a balance. We've got um, Francois. He basically looks like Yoda, trying to do an impression <laughs> of Clint Eastwood. We've decided that's what he is. He's Yoda doing an impression of Clint Eastwood. And uh, we've got... Pair Rivage. Pair Rivage. What I did there, I put him on like a little raised base. I'm going to make that like a little bit of water at the front, like he's in a bayou. But I also made it like the pig was on a ramp, like he's about to be launched off. Rocket pig was what I was thinking when I, when I built that. There he is. And finally, Ophelia herself. There she is. So hopefully you can see that there on the camera. So these are awesome models. They're very fiddly and they're very delicate. Um, that's that's my opinion on them. Yeah. Very fiddly, very delicate, but in excellent sort of poses. So not for the faint-hearted putting them together, to be honest. <laughs> um, okay, so I'll just quickly take you through the cards. And now if you zoom out, you can see the cutting mats and everything else I've been using. <laughs> So uh, these are the young old crocs. You get three of them in the set. I've shown you three of them. Each one of those is two, two soul stones. And then we've got Rami Lacox there, Lacox, Raphael. Got Claire will say that. Pair Ravage. Pair Ravage. Not Pierre Ravage, as I no. kept calling him. <laughs> and Ophelia. She's obviously the one in charge there. She's a master. And Francois. There we go. So the total there. I'll just do a quick bit of maths in my head. We've got three seven. <laughs> go on, Claire. 21. Uh, You're asking the wrong person with me. <laughs> So we've got 33 points again. Mm. Yeah. So we've got yeah. 21. We've got three sevens of six and another six with them. We've got 33 points. Is that the same points as the Nicodem box? Mm. I don't know whether they've changed it so they're all the same points now. But we'll soon find out when we open some more. And you also get, obviously, all the upgrade cards for uh, Jug Rocket. Yeah, Jug Rocket. Um, my Threatening Gun. There you go. So these are the upgrade cards for the gang as well. So there you go. So hopefully you've enjoyed seeing those models put together. As you said, they are awesome models. Very fiddly. Mm -hmm. Not for the faint-hearted, so don't uh, think they're going to be easy to put together or quick. Definitely use a knife. Definitely use a cutting mat. And use some tweezers if you can get hold of some, just for the smaller parts. There are some really tiny, tiny parts on here. Especially if you look on the pig. I don't know if you can see it on there. But it's like the ropes holding the barrels on are separate pieces. And um, the jugs are separate piece, the barrels are separate pieces, and the dynamite on top, they're all separate pieces. And um, I said the gun on Rami as well, that's all separate pieces. So very, very fiddly to put together. Take your time, that's my advice. Mm -hmm. And uh, that's it. So if you want to see some more Malifaux stuff, please let us know in the comments. Uh, please like and subscribe for more Malfoy stuff. There's a couple of box sets Claire's mm. going to do unboxing videos for yep. and show you her existing gangs. Obviously, I said previously they don't have an existing gang for these. These are the first gremlins that I've got. So um, we're going to enjoy painting these and hopefully I'll be able to show you them when I'm painted. So thanks for watching. We've been Panthony of the Geeks. And bye for now. Bye.